Something hit me yesterday with some of our, our fellow conservatives and liberty-minded friends mm -hmm. on the idea that that this attack may have not been important and may not have been Why not? newsworthy. No. Well, it's because the fact that this was a minority group that uh, that our side has attempted to legislate into the bedroom. You know, I have worked and, and, and ran campaigns and managed campaigns and consulted, as you well know, for some of the most far right-wing conservative politicians in the great state of Texas. And I stand by that, and I stand by a majority of their record. But what got me with what happened there is that several of our own within the Republican Party, that are gay Republicans like myself, could have been gunned down. That could have happened in any uh, bar or, or nightclub within the state of Texas. You know, I don't associate myself um, with the gay culture because a lot of what it stands for, and I'm not part of this homosexual agenda that we hear so much about. But for the fact and idea that anyone in this country could be gunned down in the street or in their home or in a restaurant or in an entertainment uh, area like this, this club called Pulse Orlando in Orlando just because of the fact that that they're a gay you know, citizen of, of America, it's a tragedy. And so I wanted to push out the narrative and the fact that that could have been me. That could have been some of the folks who are legislative directors and chief of staffs for Texas politicians or Republican politicians across the nation. That could be some of the biggest uh, talk show hosts, members of the legislature or Congress themselves that stand with us and activists. And that this is not a uh, bipart I mean, it's not a political issue. It shouldn't be used as a political football the way some politicians have, sponsoring ads on Facebook and Twitter, etc. This is an American issue. This is a hate crime, and this is a terrorist attack against one of the smallest minorities in the nation, and we need to circle together and stand up for our brothers and sisters in the LGBT community, whether or not you know, folks agree with them.